Hey, what's going on, everyone? Today is December 13, 2022. We're going to talk about Algorand today. See what's the potential um, for price to go higher. We haven't seen price gone up in the market in Algorand ever since like the beginning of November. Price has been trending to the downside ever since then. And even in my last video that I've conducted for Algorand, I was looking for the price to go up and it still is going down. So what's really the potential for us to actually see the market going up? Well, we might need to see all the way back to the left side of this price chart to try to get an idea to see where the bottom is going to be in at. So let's go ahead and get into this real quick. First of all, I'll be quick to tell you that yes, my last price prediction, which was produced right here on December the 4th, did not go right. And when you see these particular type of events occur, you just simply need to chop it up, learn from the situation and become more proficient at predicting at where you think prices are going to go. So let me go ahead and cut this out the way because this price prediction did not go our way. So let me go ahead and cut this out. If we were to get out now, we'd be down 10 and a quarter percent. But we don't have that far to go. See, that's one of the biggest things that I really want people to understand in terms of prices going higher, which is infinitely possible to go as high as it wants to be. There's no limit. There's no ceiling as to how high price can go. And then there's a certain restriction, certain limitation to how low prices can go. Price can only go to zero. And here we are today in Algorand trade around 21 and a half cents. And I wanted to, first of all, start off here on this particular exchange, which is Binance, to where the low could possibly come in at for Algorand. OK, so let's go ahead and zoom in here. And I think you guys can tell that we are already near a point of support into the market in Algorand, which is uh, I would say around 20 cents. That's the first and closest area that we can see the price in Algorand prop up and hold support. The second area is going to be right there around 16, like 16 and a quarter percent, no lower than all time low, which occurred on this exchange on March the 11th, 2020, which was a low of nine and a half cents, maybe like 10 cents. So these are the three areas we have. Eighteen cents. Sixteen cents. All the way back down to like a dime. Well, yeah, let's just say a dime. OK, so now we're going to utilize this line to use as a reference point and put it right in between that 16 cents between 18 and a dime. We're going to literally look for the market and algorithm come to one of those three areas. Now, looking at this on the wiki chart, I mean, we should not be expecting price to go up right now, period, because this particular exchange, this particular market and algorithm is just not bullish. And we have to wait and see. We have to wait. We have to be patient until buyers begin to come back into the market in Algorand and begin purchasing this cryptocurrency. So as of today, our idea of where Algorand is going to go is going to be continual movement to the downside until we see buyers, until we see increasing volume of the market telling us that the dynamics has changed. We haven't seen the change occur yet in the market in Algorand. You guys can see right there on the weekly chart. Here it is on the two weekly chart. And three weeks I mean there's just no life here in the market in this cryptocurrency space right now now I will tell you in the next what five days and 13 hours if this five weekly price bar looks the same way that it looks right now then yeah we're gonna come all the way back down to like 16 cents that's a quick touch possibly and then begin to possibly see the market come back up that's what I'm saying like we have to sit back and chill out and wait until the market gives us what we're looking for and if you're looking for prices to go up it's not being seen on the chart right now and one of the biggest things I would tell you as to why that's the case is when you look at these five weekly price bars right here, it would have been great for us to see the market in Algorand close about 28 cents, which is still possible in the next five days. But I mean, every day that goes on, it's becoming slim of that even occurring. Well, yeah, we would love to have seen the price in Algorand close above 28 cents. I mean, I give the market five more days, though, but I'm not too confident that that's going to happen. So let me go ahead and put this back on the daily chart. And we're going to go ahead and place some weakness into the market in Algorand. Okay. And that first price target is going to be around 18 cents. That's around 16, 17% moving to the downside. My second price target is going to go all the way down here around 16, 15 and a half cents. And I'm just going to leave it there for the time being. I'm not going to try to take it down to a dime just yet. I don't think the market's going to be extremely weak like that. And as long as price in Algorand trades below this area down here, 
around 25 cents, we're going to continue to expect that to go on, right? We're going to continue to expect that the trend, the easiest way for price to go is, go, is going to be down. And it's, until we see price break that 25 cents to the upside, that's how we're going to look at the market. Okay, so that is it. I am done. I want you all to give me a real quick price prediction, your price target and market for Algorand. Where do you think the market is headed? Leave me a comment below. And while you're at it, go ahead and join me. Hit that like button. Should have been also subscribed here to the channel to get a simplistic form of predicting prices and where market is likely to go. All right.